First question, Jay, I would like to know, um, what equation are we modelling this curve on? Okay, it is. It's a quadratic one. We know that two reasons. One, it was in the question, and two, we can clearly see, obviously, from the you know the kind of the curve that we've got there. Hi, Peter. Hello. Um, my name is Mr. Herring. I'm the head of maths. Um, so why A level maths? Well, you would pick A level maths if you love doing it, if you love the challenge and enjoy the challenge of problem solving, if you want to increase your knowledge of your GCSE maths. A level maths is for you. It's a wonderfully stimulating and challenging course. It is the course that supports many other A-levels. Pe people call it the glue that kind of holds everything together. Um, it's excellent preparation for the wide range of university courses and employers love it. They just love how mathematicians communicate, how they think, how they apply their skills logically and with resilience. With all the creative and technological advances um, that have been made, it makes maths more important than ever. And it is why jobs that require maths skills generally pay more and are most popular A-level, and it has been the most popular A-level in, in the country for about the last 10 years. So what is A-level maths? Well, there are three main areas. The first main area is the pure maths. Uh, pure maths is the methods and techniques which, which kind of underpin all the other areas of mathematics that are there. It's maths such as proof, algebra, trigonometry, calculus. I mean, calculus is just it's just the best bit that there is with our, with our maths. And without that, there would be no roller coaster design. There'd be nothing like that at all. Um, it really is. It's kind of at times it is beautifully abstract. Um, sometimes we learn it with a context. All methods we use are beautiful methods. They're, they're kind of crucial to the life that, as we know it, and the life that we want it to be. And next we have statistics. Um, oh, there's just masses and masses of work with probability and probability distributions. We're going to work with lots of data and understand what that data shows us and obviously how we use that for, for good. Uh, and finally there's the mechanics part of it. Basically it's, it's about lots of things, how things work, how they move and all the forces that kind of act on, on those things. Um, but what if I want more maths than, than A-level maths can give me? Um, well, that's where further maths comes in. Um, further maths is an additional uh, A-level qualification which you take alongside an A-level maths. It, in a sense, it's kind of uh, double mathematics and you would do that if you wanted to do a maths-based course at university. Uh, but what if I want to do more maths um, at, at Chosen Hill, but A-level maths isn't quite for me? Well, if you've got a grade four um, or higher within your maths, you can do core maths. Again, core maths is, is it's all the things that would help other subjects that you might be doing at A-level, but it also is it's kind of maths that you will face in the workplace. And so it is really geared up to kind of maths in the life and maths in workplace. Um, but why maths at Chosen? Um, well, one reason really is us, the, the teachers. Um, I can guarantee you'll be taught by phenomenal teachers who not only know the mathematics inside and out, but they love it. They love teaching it. They love talking about how to teach it. Um, it really is a passion of ours. Um, all I can say is choose maths and, and choose Chosen Hill. Thank you.